Hello everyone, Vito Z32 back for another deck review. Today we're looking at the newest deck, or a new deck from playing called Dex.com, the Royal Vortex. Alright, so this is the Royal Vortex, which was produced for the first anniversary of PlayingCardDex.com and was uh, a part of their first Pip Box Club uh, box. They had this, he has this new thing at PipBoxClub.com. Link will be down below, as well as a link to PlayingCardDex.com. Uh, you subscribe, and every month he sends you six different decks, and they're going to be good decks. I know there's going to be a bicycle branded deck included and there's a few others that are guaranteed to be included. A few specifications of decks that are to be included. And this was included there in the first one. Also, it was made available individually on the Kickstarter project he did to kind of launch the Pip Box Club. Anyways, the front of the box says Royal Vortex and quality playing cards with this optical illusion thing. It says Ivory Finish Poker Size on the one side, Demico Made in Say on the other, Limited Edition on top, and the bottom, uh, it says the Playing Card Decks.com info. And the back, it says, it shows you the back design, it says Gold Foil Back. There's no seal. On the flap, you get four pips. And it says here, as a red Ox. Whatever that is, I'm not sure. And then here we got a King of Spades reveal. Now, let's point out that this one, there was only 500 produced, so it's pretty limited. They're printed by Demarco, and they're standard Demarco faces. You get a standard Joker with Demarco and Joker and black stars and black and white. And then you get another one, which is the same, but with color. The uh, Ace of Spades is a standard Demico as well. Would have been nice if there was some customization. And then the Code Cards, they are standard as well for Demico, which are different than USB-C. But if you, I mean, if you have any casino decks, you might have, or might have seen these in the past, or you can see them on some of my other reviews. Fairly straightforward, pretty nice. And then the number cards, also fairly straightforward. The cards do have a smooth finish, and if you look closely, you can see kind of the indentations of the foil on the back. And this is the foil. It's nice, shiny gold foil. It's very interesting, swirly, optical, illusion -y. But it's like a square on a rectangle back. It's kind of weird. The borders are so thick. I don't know whose bright idea that was, but it's just pretty weird. Uh, the cards do not fan. They do have a smooth ivory finish, like I mentioned. It's supposed to be a fine European paper stock. Um, outside of that, they handle okay. Shuffle nice. Nice enough. They're not exactly made for magic or working, as you will call it. Uh, the worker's deck, but you can use it to bring out some nice, shiny gold foil it spreads nice um that is that it's an interesting deck it's a little bit pricey i would say i would give it probably a six or seven out of ten it's probably a six out of ten just weird idea for the bat design the borders i like the gold foil but the borders are weird also it doesn't handle quite gr that good, especially fanning wise. I don't know if it's because it's probably because it's a smooth ivory finish when it's probably should have been, you know, an embossed finish. It is interesting though because it's a Demaco deck or Demaco, I should say, and you don't see a whole lot of custom Demaco decks, and, and at least not recently. There's been some in the past. I'm not even sure. I wasn't even aware that they were doing that or that they do gold foil. But there it is. Um, I still prefer the other companies as opposed to Gemicore, at least as far as with this finish is concerned. And if you want to check out more Gemicore decks, I do have a playlist full of Gemicore decks that you can check out. And you'll find some of them, the quality is better than others. But that is that. Comment, rate, subscribe. Let me know what you think. 
And we'll see you next time for more tech up point card decks.com. Link in the description as well as pipboxclub.com.